finalists for the women's 50 freestyle S7. Really, Halevi from Israel in lane number one, Denise Grohl. Well, she may challenge for the medals in lane two, Sarah Mehane. She will be fast off the start. Courtney Jordan, well, the world champion, Paralympic champion back in 2008. Annie Palian, the sprinter representing Russia. Tess Rutliff in the form of her life here at these championships. She goes in six. Rebecca Dubba, also a couple of good swims earlier this week in seven. Veronica Almeida from Brazil in lane number eight. Well, you've got to think Jordan would be the class of this field if Pallian can get out strongly. She's got a very high turnover. Can she hold that for the whole 50? There's Dubba, Rootliff. Mihain, expect her to get off. Maybe the best off the blocks. Well, Jordan got away okay, but it was Tess Routliff of Canada who got the best start nearest us in the white hat, but now taking the lead, her teammate Sarah Mihain in lane number three, the white hat there, but now Graal moving through the black hat of Germany. It's very, very flat indeed, Paul. Gold medal really could go anyway as they come into the final 15. Well, Graal holding it for Germany now, but here comes Jordan and Pallian. It's Jordan and Pallian now for the gold and silver. It's going to go to Pallian, I think. Oh, it's Jordan, no Pallian. Oh, goodness. Well, I was really confused there as they came into the end. It is Jordan who takes it, and I don't know how she's got it. Pallian to take it. Oh, my goodness, I'm still confused. Pallian takes it, 33.67. Jordan, the silver. But it was so tight. Arms are flying about all over the place. I thought Pallian had missed the turn. Well, have you ever it's seen the, the lead change so many times in just a 50 metres? Well, big smile there from Annie Pallian, and rightly so, because she's not great off the start here. Look, you can see she's up first, the rest leave her for dead, and really she has to claw away, so claw herself back all the way through this 50 metres. She starts to level up a bit here and get on terms with these ladies, but it's such a good field. This is the 25 metre mark. And here's the finish. And at this point, the reason you got confused, Paul, was that slipped arm that went through. It just almost fell through the water so she could shove her right arm forward to hit the touch pad. Well, she was lucky to get away with it in the end. Well, Pallian does take it by three one hundredths of a second from Courtney Jordan with Denise Graal from Germany in the bronze medal position.